Well, hey everybody, welcome back. It is time for the dojo. This is you sitting on the couch watching, uh, watching Michael and I, the shy guys of news um, here on the dojo. I'm Jeff, and it's a me. I'm Mike, and, uh, yeah. and uh, we're playing uh, Mario versus Donkey Kong: Rise of the Minis. Is that what this is? I think this is just Mario versus Donkey Kong. Mario First, versus Donkey Kong: Rise of the Minis. I think was the second the one. The Minis has, haven't risen yet. That's the that's the sequel where John Connor goes over to the Minis, yeah. right? Um, also, how would a TV, like a TV remote with one button? Yep. Like that just seems like how does that work? Well, Is you it like just, a pressure thing, like a Metal Gear Solid Three. Yeah, you, you hit it once to go up, and then you hold it down to turn on or off, and that's that's all okay. you get. You have to go all the way back around if you miss the channels, but it's okay because there's like five. I love that the toy company is just like right across from where Donkey Kong just checked. I like that it's Mario's toy company, like uh, like Mario. He's got like he's got all the um, the Goombas working for or the uh, the. Um, Toads are working for him. Yeah. So like he he obviously went to Peach and he was like, Peach, give me a bunch of your uh, uh, people. I want to put them to work in a sweatshop, <laughs> uh, making tiny knees. Yep, making a tiny Mario's. Oh, that's weird. They cut it in half. Yeah, <laughs> like in that's the original thing. Strange. Okay. Yeah. Uh oh, everybody. Who is it? Bowser. Oh God, it's Donkey Kong. He's a psycho. Everybody, run for your lives. He'll fucking kill us all. <laughs> <laughs> I love, yeah, just one store sold out. He doesn't try any other stores. Yep. He just immediately breaks in and steals a bunch also, of Also, I like that Mario is walking right past the Mario factory over here. Well, he needs to check up on his slaves. I mean, <laughs> workers. <laughs> Come on, Michael. This is capitalism. <laughs> They're slaves. And a lot of good men died in that sweatshop. <laughs> Put them in the soup. Put them in the soup. Put yeah. them in the soup. Put the toads in the soup. It's a mushroom <laughs> soup. Oh, no. Might have just admitted to a bunch of crimes. Oh. Is this the first time that uh, we've we've done uh, Super Mario cannibalism on this channel? I don't well, remember on this channel. ever talking about it I, Not on Mike, at least. Yeah. <laughs> Where is he? Well, what is this? He's going to jam, jam his ass into there. What? Oh, into the keyhole? Why, Donkey Kong? Why? Open the door. It's a door. Here we go. All right. Uh, so I guess. Uh huh. So a lot of people don't know this is a spiritual successor to Donkey Kong '84, as as it's as it's known as. Pick up and throw objects. What was that other one that I didn't get? Oh uh, my God, was, Mario! Was, I'm pretty sure that was just like jump on the Mario. Thing jump, <laughs> Mario. What have you done? Wait, hold on. Why why does he do that? Does he just do that when I regular jump? No, but if no, I hit down, that's like to and jump. That's to jump higher. Basically. Why? But why? <laughs> yeah, because it does that. Oh. Wait, can I can I get that thingy first? Yeah, that's what your uh, yeah, that's what the ladder would have done. Wahoo! Uh, damn it, Mario! Oh shit! <laughs> Why is there a time limit on this key? Oh, because if you say you drop it on the other side, uh -huh. it, and then it just goes back to where it used to be. What? Do you, what? Because you remember where you first grabbed it? Uh huh. When the time goes out, it goes back to where you first found it. Okay. It's it's to, it's to keep oh. you from like just like leaving it wherever you want kind of thing. Oh, so like, you don't like lose around. it forever. No, you just have to go back to go get it. Oh, so this is like Doki Doki Panic rules. Yeah, like, more more picking up and throwing than. Uh... Oh God damn it, Mario! Throw like you mean it. Throw like a plumber. But yeah, back in um. Wah. A lot of people a lot of people don't know about this game, but back in 1984, there was a Game Boy game just called Donkey Kong uh -huh. that starts as normal Donkey Kong, but then kind of turns into this. Really? But without the minis. That's weird. And like, so yeah, most people don't know about it. I found out about it on accident. Yeah. Somebody was talking about this game, and they're like, yeah, this is a spiritual successor to this game. I'm like, when the fuck did this happen? <laughs> the what the what? <laughs> yeah, and I was like, I need to play this game, and I ended up downloading an emulator for it, because I played this one originally for the GBA okay. years ago. Yeah, I remember when this came out, I had zero interest in it. I loved it. Uh, That's because I wanted another Mario, you know, against Donkey Kong type thing. Right. And it was a fun little thing because you're Mario jumping around doing puzzles. Because, yeah, this is very Donkey Kong. you got the hammer. You've got the yeah, exactly. color switch. Okay. Whereas my issue with every one of the ones after this point, uh -huh. are they're like, they play like lemmings. Oh. Where you control oh, the right. knees. So and is this like... At that point, I didn't give a shit about okay. it. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, every, every, every game after this, I don't I don't care about, basically. Can it, is that just... Okay. Because it turned into something I didn't give a shit about at that point. Well, la-dee-da. Which is a shame, because I really like Can this I, game If I kill that oil thing, does it... Oh, wait. Okay. Can I... Uh, I think you have to, because to get the button up. To get the key? You have oh to wait, get the I can get up. the key from this side, right? 
Oh, nope. yeah, okay. the thing. <laughs> well, <laughs> damn it, Mario. Mar oh, wait. Oh, God damn it, Mario. <laughs> I say, God damn it, Mario! What are you doing? I'm, Mar it's Mario, man. He won't. He refuses to work with me. Damn it! I was just trying to. Okay, never mind. Just I'll go. Just... just go to where the ladder is. Okay, and then just what? And then go to the right. But what about the oil? <laughs> just don't get hit by the oil. <laughs> well, I was trying. No, he, no, he did, went straight down. He walked right into it. No, that absolutely. He, go play the video back, people. No, I was, was trying to jump. You'll between. see that he just walks right into I it. I was trying to go between the oil and the thingy. That That's was what, what I was trying to unlikely do. Unlikely story. Yeah. Okay. That's oh, what Jesus. Get fucking just give it up, Mario. Can I hit it with the with the uh, hammer? I'm sure you could. Like if I do this, and I just come down here and I get this hammer, can I hit the oil? Like I feel like the hammer's there to take out other things that's not in that area. Okay. There you go. Now don't God damn it, Mario. <laughs> okay, wait, can I just walk past it? Can I walk past buttons? Uh, yes. Yeah. Okay. All right. There we go. Oh, so we, I guess we should just grab that present, right? Or do you want to present? Uh, I was present gonna get it on the same on the way down, but that's all right. We can get it. We can get it. All right. So we walk past, and then if we get this, uh, wait. We still need to switch it. Yeah, you gotta switch it. But if I use that blue one, then it's gonna. I'll be on the wrong side of history. So wait. If I if I do this one, can I do this one? Yeah. And then I just get it. Uh, oh no. Mario! <laughs> Mario, you son of a bitch! Mario! <laughs> Damn you, Mario! You were my nightmare. I hate you that so much. That controller is really not agreeing with you, is it? It's not me, it's Mario, man. <laughs> he keeps not doing what <laughs> I ask him to. Story. Yeah. I know, I know what you think, but it's not me. It's the fucking plumber, okay? <laughs> he's drunk. He's, yeah, he's drunk with power. He's mad, I tell you. Mad. <laughs> Fighting an ape on top of the Empire State's building. What kind of horse nonsense is this? Uh, Let's see, that okay. works. Uh, God, it's when you're getting off at the... Oh, my God, dude. <laughs> okay, here we go. 19 seconds. Oh my God. I like okay. the idea of Donkey Kong just watching this and being like, what the fuck is he doing over there? <sighs> I'm, I'm, I'm doing my Mario. I'm coming up for you, you I'm, a, you I'm a doing, doing the Mario. <laughs> uh, okay. Let's jump and jump and hit this guy. God damn it. Mario, throw. Okay, there we go. Poopa doopas. Get out of my way. I'm going to hit you with the thing. I'm going to throw it away. And these are for the oils. Do they have a? D hmm? I feel like this game should just have like a straight up menu option that's just like play Donkey Kong, like play 3D Donkey Kong. Have they ever made like a just a remade Donkey Kong, but like so it looks like this instead? No, of not that I know of. That '84 one is the closest one. That was a long time ago, and it was a Game Boy game. Yeah. Should do that. Should give me some, give me some free donkeys. I'd be cool with that. Uh, okay. They should, they should make uh, Donkey Kong Jr. again, so it has this art style, but he still has the whip and he's beating Donkey Kong. Oh, good lord! Because that's the weirdest thing about that <laughs> game that people forget. Yeah. That he's just hanging out there with a whip. Okay. What is this? Is use this thingy. Yeah. Okay. Use the thingy. Okay. Go like this. They'd be like, woohoo! Yeah, I was a big fan of this game when it came out years and years ago. Okay. Um, can I jump that far? Um, you, no. The idea is that you have to put the crash cans there, the jump on. Uh, I just didn't know how far Mario could jump. I know this throw speed is way lower than I would normally expect, but yeah, these games are, are much more like precise about your jumps. Like there, he doesn't do his like super big jumps that he does in his normal games. Kind of like the Captain Toad treasure tracker of uh, yeah, Mario. basically. Ah! Oh god! For a minute, I was up. <laughs> I think there might be fall damage. Uh, okay. Like it works in like like nor original Donkey Kong physics is the best way of putting it. At least in my head, when it comes to his jumping. Sure. Because he didn't jump that high even in then. Okay. Or like maybe. God damn it, Mario! Uh, maybe original original Super Mario Bro or original Mario Brothers, not Super. Yeah. Not of the Super variety. Yeah, exactly. Um, wait, what is? Oh, he's just trying to grab nothing. Yeah. Idiot plumber. He's trying to tie his shoes. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I was trying to see if there was a run button like there is Super Mario Brothers. No. I guess it's not super yet. It's still just regular Mario. It's Mario yeah. Mario. Uh, not Luigi Mario. Uh, eh. Okay. Eh. Get the key. Okay. Go down on the thingy. I got... Uh. 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 Uh, 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 there we go. Yeah, I, always, I always wondered why they never just made more of this version of it. 
<laughs> and it was just all lemmings from then on. Okay, and they made like four of them listen, after I, that. I don't, I don't want to like, uh, I don't want to like be the the down votes that I want to see in the world, but like. I think it's because this style of Mario kind of sucks. <laughs> I, I, I mean, I don't know. I don't know. I'm, 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 I'm just like. Well, no, it, this was the perfect type of handheld Mario, though. Is the thing. Sure. Like it was. It wasn't like a Mario that was like super present. Like it's the kind of thing that like is challenging enough, but not like a giant pain in the ass when you're playing on a tiny screen. Oh wait. You have to lose. remember, this was a Game Boy Advance game. Yeah. And like my phone screen is bigger than the Game Boy Advance screen. Right. So this, like, this was the perfect type of game Damn for it. that. Uh, I gotta do it again. I it gotta would, do it again. It also would have been great for fucking, you know, like, I think the DS or after that. Mm -hmm. But but then they were like, well, everything is uh, it's touchscreen now, so they just only made um, Lemmings got, type ones they instead. They got super into that shit. They got super into the touchscreen stuff. Yeah, and so they made they made three <laughs> more after this, and they're all Lemming-like. Also, I got I got a hot take. I got a I got a video game hot take. You ready? What's that? Uh, I don't like lemmings. <laughs> I don't like lemmings either. I, I, I hate watching those little fuckers uh, die. Like I'm just not as into that as a concept of this. Just like here's a bunch of stupid idiots. Can you make them not die? And I'm like, I don't give a fuck. Let them die. Look at these little jackasses. Like I I think it's funny that lemmings alike is not a thing anymore. Right? Yeah. Like it was big for a little bit there. Yeah. They did like they did it a little bit and then they were just like, and eh, nobody really gives a shit anymore. Uh, I think Abe's Odyssey would have been one of the last chunks or those those games. One of the last uh, ones that kinda did it. A little bit. Because they had one a new little one. Bit. I don't know if that ever came out actually, I think about it. Yeah. Is yes, that still like that? Uh, no, I mean they were never like that because you were the guys you were, or uh, well, not that they were nothing like it, but they were they were less like that because you were dealing with like two or three guys, right? Not like yeah. ninety seven out of you know a hundred. You rescued ninety seven out of a hundred lemmings or uh, um, uh, Madokans. Um, okay, so I need that trash can. Excuse me. All right, that'll work. Yeah, that worked. That's enough. Oh my god, get out of the fucking way, you shy guy ass. Shy ass. Get out of here. Oh, shit. Mario, go. Ah, Mario, no. Oh, oh that was okay. close. <laughs> that was so close. That fucking Mario, man. He keeps making weird moves on me. Yeah, I'm surprised. He's very twitchy when you're, when you're playing so far. <laughs> um, there's nothing to do with the amount of coffee that I've drank today. Absolutely not. <laughs> nothing. All right. Got all three. Boom, boom, boom. This is how I almost 100%ed Mario Wonder. <laughs> Do not leave a level until you've gotten all the things from it. No, I get it. That's that's how I played this game too. This is how that's how I 99.999%ed Mario Wonder in that last level. Mode? Yeah, I think we're gonna try that how out for part two. I don't know. I don't know. I think it's just uh, me dying while uh, you solve the puzzles in three seconds. Like, I think that's probably. I haven't what played that it in a very long time. You guys have to re realize uh, as well. Uh, because again, this was a Game Boy Advance game. Oh. Uh, uh, what is this? Just. How to crouch. Okay. I guess I haven't had to really do that up until now. Yeah, really. Whee! Oh, wait. Can I, like. Do I have to go. Oh, wait. It goes in that direction. Okay, so it's fine. Yeah. Crouch. Oh. Yeah, throw down yeah. key. Then crouch. Then pick back up key. All right, there we go. Boom! Speaking of weird shit, the, the, the Borderlands, they finally came out with the poster for it. Oh yeah, I was gonna watch that before uh, we started, but then I decided I don't like Borderlands. Uh, well, it's, a, it's a behind the scenes, so it's probably just gonna be Randy Pitchford sniffing cocaine. Is it still? What What about a fucking trailer? They Do they not know how movies it's, work? It's the sneak peek to the trailer? Fuck that! And Fuck the, you guys with that bullshit! But they came Fuck out you, with Pitchford. The, they came out with the, the poster, though. Uh -huh. So it's the first time we've seen what they look oh, like. Oh shit. What? Like, legitimately. <laughs> oh, man. Because the issue before that was all just, like, the silhouette images yep. for a long time. Mm -hmm. so this is the first time we finally see what they look like. But this movie's going to be terrible. Yeah. Because they finished filming this thing back in 2021. Oh, shit. And, uh, and it's gone through three or four rewrites and reshoots already, uh -huh. apparently. And the writer of the movie already wants his name stricken from it. Yep. Because so. I think it was the Chernobyl guy that wrote yeah, it, Yeah, the right? Chernobyl guy wrote it. Wait, can I do I have to put this trash can on the conveyor belt? Uh no, you don't have to. Wait, what is it what is he doing? He's just walking around. Why? So you can fuck with it. Get it? Oh, okay. All right. Oh, no, guys, it's fine. <laughs> but what is the why is the trash can fucking with me? Oh shit. What? I fuck. think I, I think it's to teach you that like sometimes oh, God. not all the trash cans are like normal ones. Okay. Sometimes the trash fights back. 
Sometimes the sometimes trash. Sometimes the trash is not what it appears. Some, to be. Sometimes the trash takes you out. Exactly. Uh, wait, can I get up there? How does yeah, that you have work? to use oh, the jumpy thing. Little like swirly do this thing. Yeah. Okay. I like how fast he goes. Yeah. Uh, uh, yeah, that movie is going to be uh, garbage. It's going to be terrible. Will it be worse than Madam Web? Uh, I was reading the comments knows? for the people, and they're like, "I was excited," and then I saw Kevin Hart was Roland, <laughs> and the and like it's, it's so Kevin Hart seems to be the <laughs> common denominator of people being like, "Oh, oh no!" I just don't know how they got Kate fucking Blanchett to be in that movie. Like, I'm just like, well, I read the article because there's an article. I guess that was the what Wait, what's that peak stuff was? Is this just like a mini game bonus uh, game? I'm not bonus sure, mini I can't game? remember. But apparently, because well, Eli, because Kate Blanchett worked with Eli Roth on another movie, uh huh, and so he, sh he just like convinced her because I guess they were already worked together, kind of thing. Okay. Oh, I only have twenty-seven seconds to get that key. Was it going in a circle? Yeah, I think it's going in a circle. Oh no, it's staying away from me. Why is it? Get back here, key! Oh God, Michael, what am I gonna do? Just the, chase the key, Jeff. I'm doing it, but you gotta it, chase the dragon, Jeff. It's going around my. All of my efforts. Now I've got a uh, seven, five, four, three. Oh God! I almost got the dragon side. Ah, I was. Uh, that was the worst. <laughs> <laughs> this is such a stressful game. Mario can't jump. Okay. White Mario's can't jump. They called it. Um. Uh, no. Yeah. They. She. She worked with them on the movie The House with the Clocks on the Wall. Say what? I think it was the name of the movie that she oh, did okay. with him. Because right. that's like one of the few movies he, he's done that's not just like, and everybody was murdered to death. Everybody kind of was trash. And so, like, so he did that one. Um, oh, it's literally straight up. Okay. And Jack Black um, also worked with him on that movie, too. Uh -huh. So. Is that why it, that's how he got Jack Black? Well, that's part of it, but also Jack Black was already a fan of Borderlands. Ah! Yeah. And apparently there's, apparently there's a story going around that he said that he once took his son to go look at Borderlands when it was coming out uh -huh. at E3 and he asked if he could get his son in and Randy Pitchford is like I'll let you in if we make a movie and you'll be claptrap in it and he's like done and I, I don't think he like expected him to be like serious about it <laughs> wait can I just jump onto the thing no you have to have a platform to get onto it oh so can I do this now are you thinking like a Marioist like a what <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I couldn't come up with anything that didn't sound weird. <laughs> um, uh, yeah, that sounds. That all sounds absolutely terrible. No, uh, it, it, it sounds it, like the worst. Uh, I, I always flash back to that fucking e, was it E3 mm -hmm. where Randy Pitchford's like, "Here I'm on the set, yep. hanging out with all my Hollywood friends." Yep. This is me and my friend Kevin Hart, and Kevin it, Hart looks deeply confused. Yep. And doesn't want to hang out with this guy, but he has to because contractually, this man made this game. So can I take this? No. no. So do I. Um, so I hit the oil. Okay. Okay. And then whatever I get, I guess just bounce up. Yeah, just bounce up. Do I have jump. enough room to jump? Can Mario jump that tiny thingy? I don't know. That's a good point. Or am I? Maybe you can throw it. At him? No. Yeah. He, no? He okay. it. <laughs> Give it to me. <laughs> Shy guy ropes like fuck. <laughs> I like how I like how Mario throws things like I throw things in this game. It really makes me identify with Mario. Nah. He can throw things like 14 inches because that's how far I can throw things. That's true. Uh, just eh. like this is this is the closest Mario is to a normal human being. Yeah, is this game specifically can't jump very far. Kind of just walks. It really does. Doesn't I, throw very far. I'm really getting a lot of like I really am getting a lot of Captain Toad Treasure Tracker vibes off this motherfucker. No, I get uh, it. Yeah. Like, because that was very much a like, hey, remember everything you could do in Mario? Well, you can't do that here, so. This was like oh. 2003, I think, uh -huh. is what I want to say. Something so, like that. So, handstand jump is higher yeah. than regular jump. Okay, wow. Y'all see the backflip jump? Is that. Is I that think it? that's probably going to teach it. Oh, is that yeah. the backflip jump? What is that? Double jump. So, jump and then jump and then jump some more. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Great. <laughs> it's very weird. Yeah, it's a very I, strange uh, game. <laughs> I've never um, I've never been down with the whole, like, like I didn't play Mario 64. Uh, I didn't have that when I was a kid because I didn't have an N64. I was like a surly teenager yeah. in charge of my own entertainment, which was drugs and liquor and stuff. So um, I didn't have an N64. So like that, the weird, like, backflip jump thing 
We're doing a handstand to protect from falling objects. Well, that's <laughs> goddamn useful. Oh, well, well, you need to do that either way. Oops. Um, so, like, I've never really... <laughs> Why does that work, though? Because <laughs> the shoes are stronger than I, I, I don't know. Just put your shoes, take off your shoes and hold them over your head, Mario. No need to get all I crazy. I just feel like he'll just break his head open or something. Um. Oh, I could have just... Fuck! <laughs> no! You gotta stop jumping on the switches. I'm t it's not... It's t oh, I'm not... Oh, one? Okay. What? <laughs> I'm just making it dramatic for the audience. It's not my incompetence at all, okay? <laughs> I, I, I really, I, I, I really am, uh, I'm, I'm real dissatisfied with the idea that I might not be very good at a Mario game. Um, okay, here it's we made go. It's for babies, Jeff. I know. Small 13-year-old well, me. Well, wait, now, hold on. You know that I'm games kidding, for yeah. babies are rage like kryptonite. That's uh, fair, yeah. That is okay, fair. Okay, run, and then go backwards to backflip up into a thing, and then you're just like, blah! Okay, I hope I don't need that trash can. Also, what like is that moving, so. sentient pile of rocks doing? It oh, just hates us. But why? For reasons, Jeff. What did we do? What did we ever do to that sentient pile of rocks? We killed its family <laughs> in Super Mario Brothers. We're like the Joker? Where we're just destroying all their bricks. Uh, it's Mexican Joker, Jeff. Oh, shit. Okay. Boop, boop, well, that lets you get up, past up. the me without having hey, to go. There you go. Finally, some limitations with benefits. Keep calling Amiis on accident. They're mini Marios. That'd be cool if they were um, Amiibos. That would be fun. Says Mario, is he just, he's assembling his army of tiny Marios to just go out and, like, destroy everyone? Well, yeah, what it is is that once you get them, you use them in the boss fight. Uh oh. Oh. If I remember correctly, like, they like they help out in the, in the boss fight. Like, here? Or, wait, what is this? Uh... I'm not sure. Oh, well, I can, so I can I go think here, but I can't go to the next oh, thing. I think this is the Lemmings part. Oh, wait, so there is a Lemmings part in this game. Yeah, but the, like, before that, like, yeah, but everything else after that was all touchscreen related. <laughs> okay. What? It, oh, they're yeah. not. Oh, they're just following me. Yeah, but then you get them in the areas, and then they, like, slowly... Guide Mini Mario to the letter blocks. Yeah. Can I... Because they can't jump. Oh, so that means if I keep them on the ground, then I can make them go over there. Yeah, and so the idea is that you just put stuff there for them to they jump to. They can jump a little bit. Yeah, but like... Not you know as high. I mean? Like, yeah, they're not like... They don't do ladders and shit. Oh, like, wait, yeah. guys, come up here. Come up here, you stupid fucks. Come to your father, Mario. Listen to me. I am your Papa Mario. <laughs> okay, here we go. And then we they're going to murder go. the enemy. And then they're going to go through there. And then they all get in the box. Get in the box. In, 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 in. And then I pick up the box and... Now you have the box. Okay. <laughs> and that's how you play Mario versus Donkey Kong. Is, is this how you play Mario now? Is this what all the new kids... Is this the, kid, the way the kids play Mario these days? Well, this is how you played it in 2003, Jeff. Oh, okay. The times of Madam Web. Oh, sure. <laughs> sure. <laughs> in our year, the lore of Madam Web. Uh-oh. Here comes Donkey Kong. He's so mad. I don't know that monkey. His name is Donkey. Um... So we'll, yep. I'm going to take this. Yeah, so you have to hit him with that trash can. <laughs> you hit a, hit a monkey with a trash can? Okay. Can I go, like, here? Yeah, and you just here? have to keep doing it here? until he doesn't, like... And then, like, yeah, just hit him with... <laughs> just bonk him on the head just with a trash can? With trash can. What's he doing now? He's just throwing shit at me. Yeah. It's just, like, not even, like, monkey poo-poo, but, like, just literal garbage. Oh, he's got four hit points. That's I love strange. I'll just walk right in front of him and be like, what are you going to do about it? Huh? Yeah. What are you going to do? Well, he's contractually obligated to use the buttons <laughs> in front of him. Does the uh, trash can protect me from falling garbage? I don't know, actually. And where do the minis come in? I, just, I could have sworn they were in this part, but I guess I mean, like, I had a else. thing in the corner that showed me that I had them. I could have sworn there was something, but I might, I might be thinking of something else. Maybe it's remember. level two. How many levels are there in this game? Uh, I don't remember how many worlds there are. Oh, yeah. Perfect. It's a fairly short game for the most part. That's the thing. Because, again, it was a Game Boy Advance game. Yeah. A lot of those games weren't very long. Mario Toy Company clear. This was the Game Boy Advance times where you still had to use double A's. So. Because the Game Boy Advance. Oh, sure, sure, sure. Uh, whatever it was the called. SP. SP yep. wasn't a thing yet at that point. Yep. And then at that point, the games get a little longer. Man, I desperately want to go buy one of those old original Game Boys and then kit it out. They've got so many mods that you can buy. Screen mods, yeah. speaker mods, case mods, like all kinds of shit. 
Donkey Kong Jungle. Going to his house to pick him up. You played this part. Right. I'm tired of playing Mario. <laughs> <laughs> In part two, we'll do two players. I'm tired of getting Mario. <laughs> Was it A for jump in this one? It's the bottom button. Okay, cool. I just want to be sure. B and X. Da, 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 da. I don't know. Maybe the other ones will work too. Wahoo. Oh, look at that. Fucking. That's some Donkey Kong Jr. right there. Yeah. Kong oh. up them donkeys. Yeah, that was the, yeah, that was the thing about this game is they tried like adding all this stuff from some of the previous stuff. What a weird game. What a weird game to release now. Like. I would have I would have thought if they were going to do something like this that I would have expected them to have done like um Super Mario World full remake like with this art style like well yeah that is a surprising something. thing when they announced it I yeah. was like Mario vs. Donkey like I like Mario vs. Donkey Kong a lot don't get me wrong but I was surprised that this was the thing they decided to remake like but it makes some sense because uh, it was it makes some sense because it's short I guess so it's probably easier for them to remake I mean and I guess like they already have all the assets they just needed to put it together I mean a lot of these assets are just coming from other games and like Mario Wonder and stuff so yeah I think that's the main idea what did that do it. I think it just opened the bottom section. This is a really slow ass um, uh, piranha plants. I think this is supposed to tell you how to do. Two handed climb. <laughs> Wait, what do you have to do? You, you just have press to get past them. Down and then up. No, no I you mean, just you just go like this. <laughs> like what? <laughs> you just push left and right, and then you, you get it. Oh, okay. Like, yeah, because he's this and then that. Okay, then so you just that. push to the right, and then you grab both of them, and then you're yeah. grabbing both of them. Yeah, exactly. Okay. Because it just wants me to do it faster, so I don't get hit by the fire. There you go. And now I got this bitch. All right. To eBay. Where I can sell this for money. <laughs> it's limited edition. It's sold they, by Donkey Kong. They, I mean, like, surely Nintendo thought about selling these, right? I'm always surprised they didn't. As like, far as I know, they never did. Like, and also they have a deal with Lego, and these things are basically minifigs. They really are. Uh, what? That is a very weird looking rhinoceros. A rhinoceros. Tiny rhinoceros. Oh, he looks like a donkey, like Donkey Kong Country rhinoceros. Yeah, I think that's the idea. Oh, uh, with the one he rides. Oh, this is just like a smorgasbord of the Mario stuff that I'm not into. <laughs> uh, <laughs> no matter what, I just I never could do the do the Donkey Kong. Um, the Donkey, Donkey Kong Country. Itself? Well, oh, okay. no, Don I mean regular Donkey Oops. Kong didn't have very much. It didn't like resonate with me because it was it was one of those like very old, very like limited games, right? Like where you're just doing this really this one thing, like you're just jumping, you're trying to get to the top, and you've got the stuff. It was an old oh, original, original Donkey Kong. Is what yeah, you're saying. okay. And then Donkey Kong Country came out, and I was like, I this makes my eyeballs hurt. I really didn't like the way it looked. Um, That's fair. I, I really liked the original Donkey Kong Country, but it's real difficult after a while. Yeah. Like, stupidly difficult. And then, and then all, all my the sequels were like, and then Donkey Kong was kidnapped like, <laughs> every 20 minutes. I'm doing, I get all my bad takes out of the way here in part one, though. Uh, part two is just going to be all about the things I think are cool. <laughs> I don't I, but I'm talking about the bad takes in this game or just in general? Well, no, I, I'm, I'm talking about, like, how I don't like this game and I don't like Donkey Kong. I don't like... I'm just like, oh, you, what, what... Michael, what, what do you like? Name something that you like. What, pizza? Yeah, fuck that, too. All right? Like, <laughs> do you like a thing? Well, Jeff doesn't. I don't like that thing you like. So take that, just, everyone. You just make fun of uh, Borderlands all day. You know, I don't like light, air, food, music, sounds, <laughs> humans, language. Mostly language. That's how the Tower of Babel happened. Yeah. Jeff yeah. did it. <laughs> this is me. I was like, y'all need to shut up. Just shut up. You, you now know Spanish. <laughs> you now know German. I'm tired of you all understanding each other and <laughs> hugging and shit. I want more fighting and eye poking. <laughs> I feel like that's something the Grinch would do. <laughs> like if he, if, if the Grinch could pull off the Tower of Babel, he would have. I identify with, with the Grinch quite a bit. All those yeah. who's man, they're fucking keeping him up at night. That was the thing I laughed about when, like, a lot of memes are, like, when I was young, I was like, Grinch is just being kind of just mean to the, the who's about this stuff. Yeah. The, but, but the older you get, you're like, no, I get it. <laughs> like, fuck those guys. He just wants to take a nap. And yeah. I just want to sing songs about shit for, like, no reason. You know, he, was, uh, he wasn't the nicest guy, but... At the end of the day, you know, he, uh... At the end of the day, I understand him. He, he did have a dog. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> oh... That's fine. We have 14 lives. That's not enough lives. This is Mario, man. <laughs> There's no such thing as enough lives. That's true. Uh, okay. Which one is this trying to teach us? 
Oh, it's you're protected from falling standing. objects because that bird is about to poop on you. <laughs> like that. <laughs> I thought I did the thing. Oh, sh- sure could have used a one up right about now. <laughs> How do you do the one say there? It is. Just hit down and then jump. Yeah. That's a very weird mechanic. Yeah. That's a very, very strange mechanic. Like, I don't know. That doesn't make a lot of sense to me. But oh, shit. Is that bird coming back? <laughs> is he going to yeah. poop on you? To poop on. The bird okay. hits us. Why? To what, poop on us. What did you do to that bird? I guess so we also kill this family. Oh, no. I guess you could just, like, avoid the bird. Apparently, Mario just murders pe- people all the time. Yeah. Okay, and then I just got to get on the other side. Watch out for the bird. It's, like, right on top of us. Here comes a bird. You can't jump when you're upside down like that and walk, so <clears throat> you could just stay that way. Fuck you, bird. All right. Uh, my toy. <laughs> Fine. All right. Watch it. But yeah, I, yeah I, did you ever own a Mario figure at any point that wasn't an amiibo? I, did they make Mario figures that weren't amiibos? I think I had like a little... Yeah, they used to make a little figure, like toys and stuff. I, I had one that was like solid state. Like it was all one piece. It didn't have any moving parts. Oh, okay. But it was just like a piece of plastic molded into Mario that smelled funny. I had the, um, I had a John Logazamo Luigi. Oh, there you go. I got it at a flea market. Uh, and my yeah, cousin also had the Bob Hoskins one. When I was a kid, the toys were bad. Like they weren't very... They, they were kind of... Like, I never got the toys that I really, really super wanted, and the ones that I did want, like, I don't know, they just weren't very good. Like, there was, like, a, um, wait, what do you need to do there? How do you get the, do you have to hit the, oh, do you have to put the key down there and then go back and hit the switches to make them, like, open up the, yeah, I think the right the floors? So oh, wait, yeah, because I can. So put it, like, there, and then you can do, like, yep, yeah, and there, and then there, and now you're good. Um, yeah, like when I was a kid, they made that they made a RoboCop toy that had like a, but it was terrible. It had like a cat Shit. gun in its back. And it, oh, those! And yeah. it was just like I just wanted a regular RoboCop, not like this weird. Nope, <laughs> not this weird fucking like smells like cap gun caps uh, nonsense. Yeah, I, I, yeah, I remember they made a lot of figures like that over the years. Or they made that the real Ghostbusters action figures, and the proton packs had like a big, like a big piece of plastic s- yeah, spaghetti sticking out of the front. Yeah, I have a bunch. It of was those. just like, no, man, that didn't work. Like there are times when they're not doing the thing with the proton packs. I don't know. Uh, I remember when they first put out the the first line of X Men toys. Um, oh, those, yeah. I know what you're talking about. That were like, they weren't even like, they weren't even from the show. They were just like X-Men oh, the, the, toys. They were the Secret Wars ones, weren't they? Maybe. Um, so I feel well, like those like were one of the first ones they Wolverine, did. Wolverine, Archangel. Oh, no, I know what you're talking um, about. Um, yeah. I don't remember who else. No, I know which ones you're talking about, yeah. I don't uh, I don't remember, because I had a couple of them, because my brothers had them. <laughs> <laughs> it's been really weird to watch all the X-Men 97 stuff. Um, what was that for? Okay. Okay. I'm going to get that me. Okay. So the de- barrel does nothing. I, I thought you had a reason for putting that barrel in the middle. I was trying I, to figure I, out what I it was. I was trying to figure out what the barrel was for, and then I was like, wait, I can do this without the barrel. I uh, think it's in case you wanted to kill the, the rhino, I guess. Maybe. You don't have to. You, you don't just have to. It. I mean, you know. If you're trying, to, if you're trying to role play this, this is an RP server, Michael. So you yeah. should be murdering everything around you, <laughs> because everyone knows that Mario and Sonic are arch enemies, and Sonic rescues animals, so Mario destroys animals. The craziest thing about the X Men figures to me is that I never got a Cyclops when I was younger. Yeah, because my parents ended up. But my parents bought me a Banshee. I think one had a, a, a like a, a little light on the back, like yeah. you hit its back and its its uh, eyes, its like visor would light up. I yeah. think that was what that one did. I think I was talking to Blake, and I think Blake says he has it. Yeah. And I know I had the Wolverine. Uh, we had the Wolverine because all my brothers loved Wolverine, and my sure. parents were like, okay, we can get one Wolverine for like the price of three kids. And then they couldn't find a Cyclops, and they're like, why don't we get you Banshee? And I was like, who the fuck? Why? Oh, you son of a bitch! Why would I want Banshee? And and he had this little whistle thing in his back, so he could whistle. Banshee, right? He's, uh, um... 
He's, he's everyone's favorite X-Man. Everyone's favorite X-Man. <laughs> so I had that, and I was like, this is neat, I guess, because of the whistle thing. But I, we outside got of you, that, why would I want this? We got you Banshee and Polaris and Wolf's Bane. Uh, everyone's favorite X-Man. Have Merry Christmas <laughs> and uh, um, uh, Magic. Uh, yeah, like that, magic is popular now, but magic used to be garbage. So yeah, no, exactly. But yeah, back back in the day, X Men. Like I, I just remember being bummed by that when I was younger. Here's a here's a Doug Ramsey figure. It doesn't actually do anything. It's just Doug Ramsey. <laughs> like he talks to Warlock sometimes. That's his power. Like okay, whoa, sure. what the fuck? What are those? Uh, they're little, little guys that bite. Ramble, ramble, ramble. Because the idea is that you're supposed to like hit them with the fruit. Oh, okay. Do you have to go over there? Yeah, because I have to hit the switch. Button. Okay. Well, you know what? While you're doing that, I'm going to wrap it up because we are done with part one. Uh, like and subscribe, everyone. Let us know the my my take that you disagree with. Go to the comments and argue with me. I will definitely uh, look oh, at it. Shit, I shouldn't kill them. And uh, not uh, ignore it at all. Um, and then come back tomorrow for part two, where we're going to see what the fuck two player is. Yeah, I don't know what the hell that works. Um, yeah. Um, in the meantime, patreon.com forward slash rage likes where you can go to help us out. <laughs> Tell us your favorite like, banshee moment like, in X-Men. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why, explain to me in great detail, like a really long comment, like internet comment etiquette long, about why Banshee is secretly underrated and is actually the best X-Man and how I'm totally wrong and should feel bad about my opinion about Banshee. <laughs> uh, no, no, I'm, I'm serious. Like, this isn't a joke. Go do it. I will totally read it. And I'm not just asking you to do it for engagement. Um... Uh, <laughs> however, the ultimate engagement is patreon.com forward slash rage select helps out kick some bucks, get some bonus videos in return. Not some bonus videos, way too many bonus videos in yes, return. All like, of the bonus like videos. Like so many bonus videos that you're going to be like, why are there this many bonus videos? You're going to, you're going to be like, why did Jeff send me a spreadsheet? And then you're going to be like, oh my God, you need a spreadsheet for the number of bonus videos you have. And I'm going to be like, yes, yes, I do. Uh, there've been three every week for like. 10 years of change. So much of so, it, guys. You have no idea. There you go. Um, also, the Discord server. Everybody's into Helldivers right now, and they're playing Or you go to the Power World server. I recently upgraded it so that it doesn't run like ass. Um, oh, keep going. Keep oh, going. Okay. Uh, <laughs> I wasn't sure. Yeah, yeah. I wasn't keep, sure how long going. the ending was going to uh, be. Running like ass. And then, you know, also we've got a nice community full of people that are doing things. Um, yeah. Michael, tell them where they can find you when you're not over here doing the Donkey Kong. Is there a dance called the Donkey Kong? Did you do the Donkey Kong? Can everybody do I the Donkey Kong? I assume there is one. Do the, do the Mario? There is a do the Mario. Do the Mario? Bump, bump, bump. Anyway, where can they find you? <laughs> uh, you can find me on One of Us.net. We do a lot of movie television reviews. Uh -huh. I recently did a review from Adam Webb on there. Yep. Uh, it is a batshit insane review because we all were just fucking dumbfounded by Madam Wayne. <laughs> that seems to be kind of the consensus. And so we uh, were just like dicking around for most of it. So that was a lot of fun. Everybody is, is confused about why that movie exists, who it's for, why it's anything, et cetera, et cetera. Um, wait, how are you going to get the key to the other side of the spike? Oh, goes? oh no. What have you I done? I almost fell. What have you done? I almost died. Uh, <laughs> oh, but how are you going to get the key to the other side of the spike? Oh, I have to use the rhino. The rhino? You just st stand on it? Yeah. I gotta, I gotta see how this works. Uh, I, think I, I think I can throw him. You can throw the rhino? I think so. Like into the spikos? Oh my god. Oh, Mario. You fucking son of a bitch. Oh, now I gotta wait for him to come back. Why? It's because I can jump on him. You can jump that far. Not really. Okay. Solved it. But yeah, um, yeah, you can find me on one of that. That's our latest review. Um... I'm sure there's some other reviews that are on there as well that are for some stuff that's come out soon. So just go ahead and look out for those. Yeah, check it out. And then come back here. And then go back there. And then come back here. And then just do that forever. Bye.